people can expect a lot of wine at this event. Roll out the barrels, you know, people get the first taste of some of the future wines. We got a couple different bottles from the 17 locations right now that um, are actually participating in this event. And like I said, this is good stuff. It's great stuff, but you're gonna be able to taste it straight out of the barrel. I have Mike Ubik here. He's the owner and a winemaker here at Valley Oaks. Mike, tell us a little bit about the event. Well, this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, there's going to be 14 wineries, two breweries, and a distillery that you can taste wine from uh, noon to 5. There's a, a few of them that will open at 11 if you're an early riser. And, but it'd be, uh, most of the wineries will be providing a, a chance to taste something out of the barrel. And uh, the rest of them will be providing, oh, five or six different wines, maybe more, to uh, showcase what they're making here in the valley. All right, now we do have a barrel here that Mike provided us, and you guys, I want you to check it out. That's real wood. That's real wood. All right, Mike, let's, let's, let's take a look and see what's in there. So, all right, we got a glass here, and we're going to do a pouring. Now, apart from being able to taste some of these wines, you also get a chance to meet people like Mike who make these wines. And, you know, this doesn't just happen overnight, obviously. It's, it takes time, a lot of time and a lot of hard work. I mean, you know, Mike, what goes into making this? Well, it's, it's about a two-year process from picking to the time that you uh, bottle the wine. It's, uh, it, it, it doesn't happen overnight, obviously. If you want to add the growing of the grapes, it's a, th a three-year process. So you've got to grow the grapes, you've got to crush them, ferment them, press them, and then uh, you start aging them in barrels and until you uh, get to the point where you feel it's uh, ready to drink. This particular barrel, will probably bottle it in, the, in the, this next month. And so the people that come out to roll out the barrels will be able to taste the wine that we just poured Gilbert and see what it's like. Hey, so when, you know, people taste this, I'll take a whiff. Um, it's real wine, guys. It's real. Uh, what should people be looking for? Well, you want clarity and you want some, you know, something really bright like this one is, uh, something nice and clear. You want uh, some nice, flavorful uh, aromas that, uh, that come from the wine. You want to showcase those grapes. And then, of course, the flavor, everyone likes something different. So there'll be something for everyone at every one of these wineries. And I uh, hope you come out and enjoy it. All right. Thank you so much, Mike. So Roll Up the Barrels is this weekend. $10 gets you into Saturday and Sunday. And don't forget to bring your glass, guys. Make sure you bring this to get your wine. Live in Fresno County, Gilbert Maggione, Action News, AM Live. Tony Amanda, back to you. Cheers. I like that. You know, the farm-to-table concept is popular, but I like the barrel-to-your-glass concept, too. <laughs> <laughs> a little better. I, I think that's a little better, right? Who's going to complain with that about that? <laughs> exactly. All right, Gilbert, thank you.